We're gonna make more of the thing we just made without making more of the thing we just made. We're gonna duplicate the object. We have our meeple here, which we grouped together in the last video, but I think that it could use a scarf. So I'm gonna raise up this torus to 20 millimeters. And since the torus is selected, I'll go ahead and select the meeple by holding shift and clicking on it. Two shapes are selected. I'll click on the alignment tool and go ahead and use the alignment handles in the middle to line up that scarf right in the center. And then I'll click the group button to bring all of those objects together. Now we want more meeples. Go up to the top left and you'll find two little pieces of paper. That's the copy button. You can also hold control and press C on your keyboard. If you copy a meeple, it doesn't look like anything's happened until you press the paste button. In that case, you will see a second meeple arrive on your work plane. The paste button is this one with a clipboard and you can do that over and over again. Um, but what I really like to use is the duplicate button. That's this one right here. Select the meeple and then go up to the duplicate button. And when, the first time you click it, it doesn't look like anything has happened. But if you drag the meeple off to the side, when you hit the duplicate button again, it will create another meeple exactly like the one before it and the exact same distance that you moved it. So um, you can do this over and over again uh, as many times as you want. Um, I, uh, I may have gone too far. We'll see you in the next video.